Hi everyone, this is Maria Dolan, Marketing Director at Harbor Crossings. And we received delivery today of a new house. It's a two bedroom, two bath. There you have Robert Dolan, the managing member of this land lease community called Harbor Crossings, located at 6737 Black Horse Turnpike in Egg Harbor Township, New Jersey. This is located in Atlantic County, New Jersey. It's really a resort area. And there you see some of our vintage homes. And this is a newer home. This is a manufactured home following the construction codes set by the federal government under the HUD, the HUD code. And our driver is Ron. And these houses are built by Redmond. It's a division of Champion Homes and they come um, our particular homes they have manufacturing facilities all over the country and our particular homes are built in Ephrata, pennsylvania and then they're transported to our location right now during covid uh, we used to order a house and it would take six weeks to get it and now during covid because of all the shortages including labor and supplies we're getting houses um, uh, six months out so um, the demand is higher than what we can supply and we're just building them as quickly as we can. So this house uh, had a very easy entry through this particular field and um, we have a lot of construction uh, crew on hand to help out and they have the bobcat there because they thought they were going to have to move it with the bobcat but in this instance um, our driver is so expert he can just pull it right through. So this was very easy to um, put the house on the site. These houses are very similar to modular homes. They come on a steel chassis and they're kept on that chassis. A modular home is lifted up with a crane off the steel chassis and then um, lifted onto a foundation, which is either a crawl space or a basement. In our case, we build this particular foundation that you see here. I've done a lot of other videos that describe our um, foundation system. It's all concrete, it's pretty expensive, and uh, it's six inches on the periphery and 12 inches uh, in the center, or maybe the other way around. And then you see there, those are footings that we put, um, the circle parts, and they go beyond the frost line. And then after the house is positioned on the house, you will have concrete piers that are built on top of that and that will adhere to the bottom of the steel chassis. So it's a very firm foundation and um, tried and true. Mr. Dolan's been in the industry over 35 years and um, feels like this is the best way to make the house um, stable and give it some longevity. Um, he does a vapor barrier first, and then the concrete, and then um, the piers, and then the, uh, we, what we call the concrete um, strapping. So those are steel straps that get adhered and bolted to the whole house and to the concrete. And so therefore, any myth about hurricanes is never going to happen because these houses really can't be lifted. So... Um, we're going to take a look inside the house in a little bit, so stay tuned, and I will have photographs afterwards uh, at the end of this part of the video so you can see more closely um, how the house is inside and what the concrete um, foundation is. Uh, what you see here, this is 21 Bowen Avenue in Egg Harbor Township, New Jersey. And across the street, we have uh, a completed uh, street where all the houses are um, the most innovative, modern, manufactured homes in the industry. Here, and we're gonna show you around. This is how the house arrives. I just started taking off the rubber bands, but I thought, hey, you guys should see how we do this. So when the house arrives, this little bit of rubber band helps give a little bounce to the house on the highway. I forgot what our floor plan was with this. This is remarkable. The white kitchen, because we're close to the 
um, 15 minutes from the beaches. So it gives you a really nice resort feeling. Oh my gosh, this is pretty. I'm just gonna go around and do my normal job. So here's all the things that are on the counter. This house has the Champion 7 um, warranty. So the manufacturer warranties the house um, 30 days cosmetic and uh, year one is through the manufacturer and year two through seven is this um, program that we purchase with the house. It's only a $50 deductible so it's worth doing and it includes um, budget protection, home image, no this is not what I wanted to say to you, uh, appliances, air conditioning, plumbing, electrical, heating, and structural. This is the reasons for selecting this kind of um, warranty. So that's pretty cool. And here's some more little items that are on here. The how they test it, how they adjust the doors. Now all our guides do all this before we actually have a closing. And this shows you the certificate of final acceptance and quality and this comes from the company. These are all the people that work there. I know all these guys, they're awesome. And uh, let's continue looking at the rest of the house. So like I said, we have, um, wow, new stainless steel dishwasher. That's a Whirlpool. Feels more heavy duty than the other ones. So there's been such a, a COVID um, uh, problem with appliances that um, I'm really thrilled that that came in. They've been upgrading because of all the shortages. Even the fire in Texas caused a problem with the refrigeration and glue and the insulation in the refrigerator. So here's a beautiful refrigerator. Again, it's a Whirlpool and it's stainless steel. So I'll go around and do the rest of the rubber bands later, but this kitchen is enormous. You've got um, the crown molding on the top, a nice view from this side. I'm gonna go back and highlight this little area here is for your table. You've got LED lighting above. Of course, the electricity's not on since the house just arrived. This is a beautiful hutch area. You could do your coffee bar or your baking bar here. This is a cute little uh, peek through, so you can put some cute little shelving items there, decorative items. Even this side's nice. You could come in, lay your mail down, put your laptop here. It's a great little area. Wow, I'm really pleased with how this design came out. It actually makes the kitchen enormous. So that's the kitchen. Let's go back to the right side here is your laundry room. And you've got your area for your washer and dryer. Again, the white cabinets. Here's your back door. And this would be your master bedroom. This has your own closet. I'm sorry, your own bathroom. So here you have the commode. When the house arrives, the commode lid is under here to protect it for the travel. So there it is in a box. Here's underneath. And again, all the cabinetry has the rubber bands. It's pretty deep. You could, put all, you could put a little hamper in here, that's awesome. And here you could do your towels, stack all your towels and more towels or medicine or whatever people put in the bathroom, all your supplies. You've got a cosmetic box above the toilet. You can put medicine in there too. You've got a great little window with ventilation and it's horizontal for privacy. So this is the elongated bowl. That's an upgrade. Here you have your counter and your porcelain sink. This matches the kitchen. This is the Bronzino um, design in the counter. So pretty. Nice. Over here you have your step-in shower area. We'll put in the glass doors. Got your transom window above your shower and then the fan. 
and then we'll put the lights and the globes uh, above the mirror. So again, here's your first bedroom. Let's take a peek inside the closet. This closet is enormous. It runs pretty long back there. I like to always show people the data plate inside the closet and the shutoff valve for the whole house is in the closet. They typically go under the house, but we put them uh, in an accessible way. We also provide you a door that gives you direct access to the hot water heater. And there's the warranties on that. So the warranties are also for each appliance. I'll have to shimmy that door and you know when they um, balance the house underneath, they'll fix all the doors. So there's a view of the living room. Two windows on this side, one window on this side. Lots of light. Wow, this is awesome. The whole house is vinyl flooring. This is a beautiful color. It makes it very light and airy. Here's the other bathroom. Again, the lid for the commode is securely stored underneath. This side is uh, a step-in tub. Again, a one-piece fiberglass unit, the transom window, the cosmetic box. And then we'll just take a look at the sink here and the mirror and the light fixture. Um, the boxes in the living room are all those items that we still have to put up. So another peek here. Let's take a look this way. Really pretty. Here you have your furnace. Now this will run your forced hot air and the central air conditioning. And again, let's go back to the living room for a second. And, oh, it's not in here. Uh, it's gonna be somewhere else. Maybe it's in this back bedroom. So the things that I were looking for, um, there they are. There's the globes and the light fixtures and the cover for the furnace. So this is your uh, second bedroom. It's a pan from one side to the other. Big windows. Lots of closet space here. And it's got a wire rack in both closets. So here's the truck. It's still hitched, I believe. Yeah, it is. Came all the way from Ephrata, Pennsylvania. There's our driver, Ron. Mr. Dolan walked by first. And then Roger is the follow-up car. So again, same flooring. So if you're interested in this house, whoop, the door's opening. You go to the website, myhomeinharborcrossings.com and fill out the 15 pre-qualifying questions. This house should be ready in two weeks time for tours. So um, only those people who've answered that are eligible for tours. And then the resident application is a totally different thing. I've had a few people think that the 15 questions is the application. No, it is not. It's how we start the intake process. And that intake process uh, causes a whole bunch of things to happen. First of all, you're gonna receive the informational email that tells us tells you all about Harbor Crossings, what we're building, what we're all about, about our family, and then you'll get um, email confirming your answers, and then you'll get an email for financing if you need it, and then you'll get an email giving you the online link. The online link for applying is now live. It's taken me a long time to get that activated, but it's ready for everyone to apply online instead of having to mail in or drop off the applications. Um, I'm still allowing people to do that for a short time, but that's not gonna last much longer. Um, eventually, we will just use the online link. So go to the website, myhomeinharborcrossings.com, and we look forward to seeing who will be the lucky homeowner. Thank you for stopping in. Please like and subscribe and share the video so that other people can know what a wonderful location Harbor Crossings is. We are a land lease community. 
We are located at 6737 Black Horse Pike in Egg Harbor Township, New Jersey. This house location is 21 Bowen Avenue in Egg Harbor Township, New Jersey. We're in Atlantic County, New Jersey. We are 15 minutes from Ocean City, from Margate. There's great shopping here. There's a super Walmart. And Egg Harbor Township is just now about to redevelop a whole nother area. And we are smack in the middle of it. We are right at exit 37 on the Garden State Parkway. And um, I don't know, 15 minutes from Atlantic City. There's just so much here, entertainment and universities and education and um, resorts and the beaches and oh, I could just keep going. Anyway, you gotta go check it out and we look forward to hearing from you.